punch it in the nose and the muzzle. Guard yourself, take your shirt, your jacket, whatever you have, maybe even a messenger bag or a purse. Give that dog something to go after so that it's not going after any other vital areas of your body. Take your shirt off, put it around your arm. You wanna protect mainly where the ulnar and radius flow because that's where your major arteries are. So if you're gonna give a dog your arm, give it their forearm, not this side because that's where all your vital arteries are. Punch it in the nose and the muzzle. Reason being is the muzzle and the nose is gonna be right there front and center. It's a big target. You can go for the eyes and some other areas of the body, but the reality is those are small targets. You wanna go for big targets. When you're under stress, gross motor skills are about the only thing that are gonna work. So that means big movements by you to big targets on the dog. Anything else you'll probably miss and give the dog an advantage. Kicking it behind the arms near the rib cage is also another alternative because it's very sensitive underneath the armpits just like it is for us. And if you're gonna fight, fight with vengeance and try and make that dog understand that you are the alpha. Mm -hmm.